Hey bros chicas, welcome to a new vlog. I just got my package from Aerie. Just got my package from Aerie. These are the panties that I ordered for Black Friday. So I'm gonna show you them real quick. They had a bunch of holiday prints and stuff, but I, I just got like regular colors, but I had to get a red one, of course. These are called, oh man, what are they called? These are the boy briefs, I think. Yeah, the boy briefs. So these are my favorite style. They are super comfortable, full coverage, and they go up um, pretty good. Not super high-waisted, but I would say to the belly button. And they're very stretchy. This is a new kind of lace, and it feels like very soft. It's supposed to be like a wintry snowflake lace, I think it said. So I got the red. I got this oatmeal color. Same, same thing. I got two black because black is like my favorite. So I had to get two of those. Um, I also got a gray. And then this is a new style I got. Um, I've never tried these, but I'm very excited. And I they look super comfortable. I hope they're comfortable. They look a little more high-waisted than these ones do. And these are the boy, boy shorts or boy boxers. Oh, I can't remember the style. Maybe I'll like just put it in the drop down so you guys can see. Um, but... They have a lace on the leg here. Hopefully this fits my big thighs. That's my one concern that I have with these. They, I tested out, they feel really stretchy. So I'm hoping that they fit my big thighs. This is like a very pale, pale, like lavender type color. It's hard to tell. Um, but yeah, these look basically like boxers for women. And I just feel like it would be good for winter time. Um, so I also got black, of course. And then I got this really cute little cream colored one with these little red flowers. And I got this color. I love this green, this like sagey green with a little, it looks like cotton or little white flowers or something. Yep. And everything is in a size extra large. That is my size that I get from there. So I am really excited about these. I'm going to take a shower and I'm going to put some on and let you guys know how I like them. I did get one more pair, um, but it's it's not here yet. This one came like so fast. Like, today is Sunday. I ordered it on Friday. That's crazy how fast it came. It must have just came directly from the store. Um, but I'm still waiting on one last pair because this is nine pairs and it was 10 for 35. And the last pair is a high-waisted lace underwear. Um, I wanted to try a high-waisted one, see how that fits for like certain pants that are high-waisted. Also... My belly always, sorry, the kids had YouTube on. <laughs> um, my belly always wants to flop over my underwear and I hate that. So I was like, let me try um, a high-waisted pair, you know, in those certain kinds of pants that your underwear always, you know, wants to go below your belly. So anyways, I really hope these lady boxers work out because they look really promising. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys the boxer ones. They're called boy shorts, by the way. Um, that's what it says on the tag. And they fit my thighs so nicely, thank God. I was so afraid, like I've had biker shorts before that like were cutting into my thigh, the seams. Um, these feel very, very comfortable. They're not gonna work with panty liners. I usually wear panty liners. Um, I'm trying to wear one now, but um, it's there's such a wide spot down here, which is great for like fupas and big kitties and stuff like that, which other underwear don't account for. Um, this is great, but if you're like on your period or wearing panty liners or anything, these are not going to be the ones to wear. But these are so comfortable and they come up pretty high. They hold my whole belly in. I don't, because of the band, I don't see this rolling under my stomach. So overall, good find. I recommend these. Uh, these are so comfortable. You could even just wear these like with a t-shirt around your house because they look like little shorts. I love it. Good morning. It is Monday, Cyber Monday to be exact. <laughs> um, I just wanted to give you guys another update about those underwears, those boy short lady boxer underwears. So I slept with them. They're comfortable to sleep in. They will ride up your thigh though. So just know that they will go up into the crease. They naturally just want to find the crease. So that part is like a smidge annoying. Um, but I think these are good sleeping underwear. And I think these are good to wear with big like jogger sweatpants like big sweatpants 
I don't think I would wear this with jeans or anything, but it's just like a comfortable lounge underwear if you wanted something like that. So um, that's, I just wanted to give you guys some details that I've noticed over the past 24 hours. Uh, very comfortable. It feels like you're just, you're not even wearing underwear. It kind of feels like you're going commando because it just feels like you're wearing shorts. Um, but sleeping in them was good. Yeah. I, I don't think I would wear these with like skinny jeans or, or tight leggings or anything like that. I would wear it with like sweatpants. Uh, so anyways, this acne is driving me insane. I look, uh, what is going on? Like, I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed. I'm ovulating right now. So that's probably why I still have pimples. I mean, I tell you out of a whole month, I probably only have a week and a half of good days. And the rest is just like surrounded by PMS and all those symptoms. It's like, it's ridiculous. But today I have a lot of work cut out for me. Um, we ended up, hold on. So thirsty. We ended up getting all the stuff out of the downstairs office by the sitting room. But a lot of it was clothes bags, so all those clothes bags are now in my room. So I have a lot of stuff to put away, and I'm like trying to find the motivation to do so. I started a new cup of coffee. I'm just trying to get myself to get going. Usually I like to talk to my sister on the phone while I'm trying to clean and stuff because it just helps me. I don't know why do you guys do that like it really just helps me get cleaning done when I'm talking on the phone with somebody but she's not awake yet so I'm like come on find the motivation all I've been doing is uh trying to make selections for a new haul that I'm gonna do um but then I wanted to take a break so I switched some laundry I've been doing some laundry this morning that's about it but I need to get my ass upstairs and put stuff away I just really don't want to <laughs> Okay, so I'm hungry already and I don't feel like having a shake right now. So I'm going to have these Birch Benders Keto Toaster Waffles. They are six net carbs for two of the waffles. Um, Gluten-free, no added sugar. And then I have this sugar-free pancake syrup. Um, I'm going to have this for breakfast. All right, y'all, I'm still hungry. <laughs> so I'm going to have this yogurt. It's the Oikos Triple Zero. 15 grams of protein and this is strawberry banana okay i'm gonna eat lunch it is 1 30 i just folded so many clothes i did go upstairs and fold like half or maybe like a little bit half than the clothes that were in my room um but i have some eggs with a little bit of cheese and three of these little maple sausages and that's gonna be my lunch Good morning, it's Tuesday. Um, I decided that today I wanna go get a haircut. So I um, just called a few places. I couldn't get answers from anybody except for one place. It's called The Color Bar. I posted something in my town's Facebook to like get suggestions for hair places. So it was one of the suggested ones. Um, but I get so ner I get so nervous, like so nervous when I try new places to get my hair cut. So mm, I'm like freaking out, but I really want my hair cut. As y'all know, it's been pissing me off and I think I look really good with short hair and I'm excited for it. Um, I'm gonna do a little bit of makeup because this is horrendous and i said this the last time i got my hair cut which was like well actually i said this a year ago i was watching my old vlogs to see my haircuts um but i always have to have makeup on when i get my hair cut so i could like see what it looks like so i'm gonna do a little bit of makeup just so i can feel good about myself i'm probably just gonna do concealer i'm not gonna do Actually, I might do like powder foundation, but I'm not going to do liquid foundation. I'm just going to use some concealer for these bad boys over here. Ugh, they're pissing me off. I also don't know what to wear today because it's so freaking cold. Um, 
and I like I want to dress cute today like I'm just in the mood like I want to be cute today but I don't know what the hell to wear you know when you want to be cute but you don't want to feel the uncomfortableness of cute because cute isn't always comfortable that's how I'm feeling like I just want to throw on sweatpants like I always do but I'm wearing leggings right now and a sweatshirt um but I think I'm gonna change Actually, I think I'm going to keep these leggings on because these leggings are pretty thin and they are like fleece lined. So I was thinking about wearing them under jeans to give me extra warmth. I'm thinking that because it is 22 degrees today uh, with a windshield of, well, is it windshield? Is that how you say it? Well, it feels like, it's a feels like a 14 because of the wind. So it's freaking cold. <laughs> Um, but yeah, that's what I want to do today. Like, I feel like I need to get out of the house. Like, every once in a while, I need to, like, take myself out of the house. Just because I'm such a hermit now. Like, all I do is stay home. And I need to get my car running. Because, like, it's um, bad to just let it sit and not run it for a long time in the winter. So, I want to just take it out. Uh, but yeah, I just, I need to get out. And I've been meaning to get a haircut. I've been kind of procrastinating on it just because I'm so nervous to try a new, you know, a new stylist. Like, oh, I'm so nervous, dude. I have a picture, though. I'm going to use the same picture that I used a year ago to get my haircut. It's the one of, what's her name? Demi Lovato, I think. And it's just like a short bob with, like, texture. Not super short. Not super short. Like shoulder length I think yep that's where I'm at guys oh I feel so ah, I have anxiety today I have anxiety I do I really do have anxiety today it's fr it's frustrating um but I think it's just because like oh, I'm so nervous to get my hair cut but I really don't want to sit in this house today even though it's freaking cold like I need to just get out other than that, I have to just, you know, clean the house like I normally do. But I want to get this done first. So they had an appointment available at 1030. It's 930 right now. So I'm just going to get myself ready. All right, so I just got back from getting my hair cut and she like put a couple of curls in it. Here is how it looks. I feel weird. I feel weird having short hair again. It's crazy. She put some curtain bangs. There's like a lot of texture. It's a little bit shorter than I intended. I will admit it's like a little bit shorter than I thought. It's like above the shoulder. But then this one, you know, this part comes down longer. So I like that a lot. But yeah, here's how it looks, guys. Here's how it looks this way in the mirror. So it's definitely like this, which I love. But it's like a smidge short. It's a smidge short. But you know what? Hair grows. I think I'm just like in shock to have short hair again. But it's really cute. I mean, I feel cute in it. Guys, look how cute this little bun is now. I know I said I was not going to do buns when I have short hair, but, like, look how cute this is. I love a little bun with short hair. Okay, so I know this was kind of, like, a short vlog, but I'm going to go ahead and end it here and upload it for you guys because tomorrow is the first day of Vlogmas. So I can't decide if I'm going to be uploading <clears throat> on the day of or, like, the day after. But I think the day after would just give me a lot more time. So that means I will fil I will be filming the day, for example, December 1st, and then I will be uploading it on December 2nd. Um, so it'll just be like 24 hours after the actual time it happened, if that makes sense. So anyways, yay, stay tuned for Vlogmas. Uh, to be honest with you, I don't have anything planned for it, but I will try to make it as fun as possible. It's just going to be daily vlogging, which I do all the time anyways, but <laughs> hopefully you guys will like it. And yeah, so thank you for watching today's uh, vlog. Love you guys. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next one. Bye.